Hey folks, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we'll cover the topic of methods to delete user mailboxes in Exchange Online. You can opt for two ways. Microsoft 365 Admin Center or Windows PowerShell to delete Exchange Online mailboxes. When you delete a mailbox using the Microsoft 365 Admin Center or by Exchange Online PowerShell, the mailbox is considered soft deleted, as it remains in Azure Active Directory and can get recovered within 30 days. You can permanently delete a soft deleted mailbox using the Remove Mailbox commandslets, with the Permanently Delete parameter in Exchange Online PowerShell. But before going to delete, you must be aware of some facts about how to delete, recover or permanently remove a mailbox from Exchange Online. When any organization decides to retain its former employees in such cases, the organization needs to have mailbox content. In such cases, the soft deletion of mailboxes becomes helpful. But if you want to hold the mailbox before deleting the Microsoft 365 account, the mailbox will become inactive. We will use Microsoft 365 Admin Center to delete an Exchange Online mailbox. Here enter your login credentials and now go to the admin. A new Microsoft 365 Admin Center screen window will appear here. Go to the users, then click on the active users. Here, select the user you want to delete and then select the delete user option to delete the user mailbox. Now your selected user mailbox in Exchange Online is deleted. When you are done deleting the user mailbox from Exchange Online account, you can remove the license assigned to the account to avoid any further cost on it. Even after removing the license of the user mailbox account from Exchange Online, the data within the user mailbox retains for about 30 days, and after that, it gets permanently deleted. Within these 30 days, users can activate the license in the user mailbox. Now one thing you need to understand is the importance of data and mailboxes before deleting them. Once the data is deleted permanently, there is no way to recover them. Hence, you can go for the Kernel Office 365 Backup and Restore tool to the backup important file without performing a backup of the whole mailbox using the filter option. To know more about the tool, visit the given link. Have a nice day.